That. Oh no! It's everywhere! Oh! Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am joined with my sister today. Hello. Um, we are going to do a Costa versus Starbucks Veganuary. So both places have some new vegan items on their menu, coffees and food. So we're going to try them out. <laughs> Hi, um, can we have the new caramel oat latte please? Of course, medium. Yes please. And a no hazelnut almond latte as well. Medium as well. Yes please. Fabulous. Anything else? Um, have you got the new vegan toasty? Panini or whatever it is. The chicken and bacon, what, chicken and bacon, chicken barbecue one. Yeah. Can yeah, have I that do. as well please. Just one of those, sorry. Yes please. Yeah, not Hello. a problem. Yeah. We've also got some lovely apple crumble flapjacks, they're vegan as well. What's this? Apple pie flapjack or something? It's <laughs> giving me rank. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh. Hiya. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, I can't reach you. <laughs> Wait. Well, I told you we'd be able to reach. <laughs> there out. she is. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> What's he about that stuff? Thank you. Bye, you two. So you think she's doing real? Let's see what? You think she's doing real? We um, love a pink steering wheel. Right. <laughs> We've been roped into buying something else we don't want. Oh, it's spiced. Oh, no. I just mean cinnamon, I think. Yeah, I ate cinnamon. So, so what, what did you say? Sea coat. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, Costa have got new lattes that have got, what is it, extra B12 protein. Cinnamon. I think you could have these, like caramel oat and what's yours? Mm. Hazelnut. Hazelnut almond. Hazelnut almond and vanilla. No. They've got B12 caramel and oat. zinc. Why does it say all protein? Oh, it was. Oh, yours has got B12 and zinc in, and mine's got protein. <laughs> um, but I think they've done that. I don't know if it's just advertising. I don't know if it's just to get more people to buy it. Put... But base, if you're vegan, you you're usually low in B12. It's the one thing that you can't really get from vegan food. I have it without milk. Is this almond milk? I don't even. Yeah. Like, I don't even like almond milk. Where's the apple? And then. We knew that this was the new sandwich, which is the barbecue chicken. That barbecue chicken panini. Well, it's not chicken. Um, and then we got roped into buying this apple pie. Sorry, <laughs> we got roped into buying this apple pie because it's vegan. And I thought it was going to be like in, out of the cake section. Yeah, I did. I'm not complaining because it's um, half price on food in Veganuary. It smells like the Domino's Texas like, um, barbecue pizza. Mm. Like it smells exactly like that. Oh yeah, it does. Oh, it's got chicken, barbecue, cheese, spinach, peppers. It's about it. Looks nice now. Eat. Oh, cheesy. You can have the bigger piece. <laughs> Why? It smells like a Domino. It smells like Domino's pizza, doesn't it? Exactly like it. Mm. Not caramel. That tastes like pizza. <laughs> I'm gonna say it literally tastes like Domino's pizza. It tastes oh, exactly it like Domino's Texas barbecue. Tastes like pizza. Mm. If you're craving a pizza, go to Costa. I'd give that a good nine. Mm. I wonder what vegan cheese it is. Mm. It don't feel like that oh, sticky one. You've got a Costa in the car. Mm -mm. I really like barbecue stuff though. I do. So I won't get a whole piece of barbecue because I think that's too much. But this, mm. yeah. Mm. <gasps> uh oh. Yeah. Hundred percent would buy them. The chicken is. I wonder if it's jackfruit because it's quite like pulled pork taste. Mm. It looks like pulled pork as well. Where is it? I wouldn't say it's chicken. I would have advertised it as a pulled pork. 
Yeah. Or pulled chicken panini. Mm. I need a tissue. Thank you. Mm, that was really nice. Now I'm going to ruin it with a stupid cinnamon flapjack. The only thing I would say is that it might be because that's the first thing we've eaten today, so we're starving. Yeah, true. Everything tastes nice when you're starving. And if you don't like barbecue, you probably obviously wouldn't like it. I'm not a massive barbecue person. Oh, I am. Like, I'd never choose it, but then I would have that again. But then I'd rather I would definitely have that again. I would... I'm not even going to smell it because I won't like it. <laughs> You're not saying much. I forgot it was flapjack. I just hate apple pie. Oh no, it's the. I like apple pie, I think. I like apple crumble. I wouldn't say it's spicy, though. I wouldn't say it's cinnamon or anything. No, I think that's why I was surprised. That's nicer than I thought it was going to be. I mean, I won't choose it again. Oh, I would. I'd... Yeah, but you're weird, like. It's really sweet, which I like. But it's, it's, it's not like. Like, for example, the apple pie from McDonald's is too much for me. It's too. too cin cinnamony. Cinnamony. I don't feel like cinnamon at all. Cinnamon. No, this isn't. <laughs> The apple pie is though from mm, McDonald's. I don't know how you say that. No, I mean the apple pie. Oh, I think I've got a big bit of apple though. It's appley. Mm. But in It is the definition chunks. of an apple pie mixed with a flapjack. I mean, it's apple crumble. No, mm, I've got a big bit of cinnamon. Yeah, no, I wouldn't buy that again. I'd buy it again, but it's just that first bite. I don't really like fruit in things yeah it's the first bite as you chew it gets nicer mm. I do. <sighs> anywho anyway we're going to try my coffee now get that here get that pretty oh yeah it's very caramelly is it mine's um would you like to try it i should have asked for sugar free caramel oh i think mine's gonna be nicer than yours Yeah, that's very nutty. I prefer that one. Yeah. I don't think that tastes like coffee. This is does. more sweet. That's more like, it's got two, that's two nuts, so it's like more, what's the word? Like, it's not as sweet as this one. It's sweet, but it tastes more like coffee than that one. Mm. That one, just, if you don't really like coffee, that one's nice because it just yeah. tastes like milk, caramel. Caramel milk. <laughs> <laughs> caramel drink. I think it's, if, if I'd not been drinking um, hazelnut milk recently, then I think I'd have been a bit like, hmm, because I've been drinking hazelnut yeah. milk in my coffee in the past few weeks. I'm trying to think how I how would feel if like, I'd gone from not being, like, not drinking Yeah, I got what you mean. Milk. It's quite nice. It's more like... Very nice, actually. I want to say, like, like, harsh, but not that word. Yeah, it, it is a very overwhelming nut taste. But not of almond milk, not of almonds, because I don't like almond milk. No. More of hazelnut. Which is like a hazelnut latte. I think that's because they've obviously used a syrup for the caramel and a syrup for the hazelnut. Yeah. I prefer this one. Yeah. Yeah. We'll try that one again. We'll try that one again. Mm -mm. No. If I wanted a coffee, then this is more coffee. But if I wanted something more sweet, then that's more sweet. It's very sweet, this one. Because I used to love a caramel latte, but then I kind of overdid it, and now I'm more... I want to know what the vanilla, the vanilla coconut one tastes like. Coconut, I presume. Because this is very... I think nutty. the vanilla coconut one is def... I don't know why I got this one. I think I was more intrigued about caramel. Because that doesn't really have a flavour. No. So that's more like just a caramel drink. If, you go, if you're going from just having a normal coffee to wanting to try the new vegan ones, I would say get the oat milk one. Yeah. If you're used to having like a caramel latte or a vanilla With latte or whatever. Milk. Cow's milk, sorry. Yeah, then I would say get this one because oat milk is the least, like it's the closest to normal milk taste, isn't it? Mm. Oh, sorry. So, yeah. Sorry. Mm. I even think that's not very milky though. I think that's got a, like a weird taste to it. To be fair, if you put oat milk in tea, then it, tea tastes more normal, but if you put soy milk in tea, it tastes mm. more 
looks weird. Hey. I hope not, it doesn't curdle either. I don't think any of them do. She, sure something does. wrong with her making hot drinks. Every hot drink she makes, it curdles. It does. Even Emma says the same. Every time we go to Emma's and I make a cup of coffee, she's like, what is wrong with you? I don't think mine's ever curdled. It's vegan, gluten, wheat and milk free. So basically it's apple in a bar. So basically it's an apple. <laughs> basically it's one, is it one of your five a day? Yeah. I like that because the McDonald's apple pie is proper cinnamon. I don't think it is. I actually don't know if I've had one or not because so that's a lie. <laughs> I, well, I nearly put it on the list and then I thought I'm not because I don't even like it. I think I've tried Dad's before quite a few times. <laughs> Very would highly recommend the coffees. And <laughs> I've got to have another coffee at Starbucks. And the sandwich. I might have a cold one. <laughs> well, that's a good idea. They've got some new ice ones. And we'll look at the menu. Yeah, 10 out of 10 for the coffees. I prefer this one to yours, but if you... I prefer this one to yours. Depends yeah. what mood you're in. This one's more coffee -y and nutty, and that one's more like a caramel drink. This is like a dessert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Apple pie, mm, that can have like a... I would actually buy that again. 5 out of 10. I'd give it a... I'd give it a 6. You could buy something again that's a 6 out of 10. I mean, if I was like in the mood for something sweet, but I didn't want chocolate... I would buy that, that again. Doesn't exist. But yeah, I would buy that again. I would recommend that. And the you sandwich. That. Yeah, I'd recommend that to someone I know that likes apple pies. I'd be like Dad. Oh, I've tried that. I wouldn't be like, it's amazing. Go and buy it. Oh no, yeah, no, probably not. <laughs> yeah, it's nice though. I would eat it again. And the sandwich <laughs> was ten we out of ten. Stare into the distance as if we've got a lovely view. We don't. Yes, we We're not. looking at gates. It's and a bin. Yeah, it's yeah. So it couldn't really get worse. No offence if you have a bit of hundred. <laughs> <laughs> I really like the big ones. I was thinking about getting the big one. They're really nice. Anyway, that's Costa. Now we're going to Starbucks. Yeah. See you there. How nice was that girl? Also. Oh yeah. We have um, one each of the, of the, the honey cane with the double chocolatey one. Yeah, medium or larger? Just medium, please. Over ice with um, the the new Starbucks nut blend milk, whatever it is. Yeah, no worries. Anything else? Um, and then can we have the new vegan breakfast sandwich? Oh, we haven't got any left, sorry. Uh, just get the cheese and um, marmite. Have you got the cheese and marmite one? Uh, I'm not... I don't think so. Just let me um, get my colleague to check because I'm making drinks so I can't really move. Okay. Um, was it the cheese marmite? Sorry. Yeah, or if not, the the chicken wrap, the new vegan chicken wrap one as well. Starbucks is not coming to me. We haven't got the marmite, but we've got the new chicken and barbecue one. Yeah, we'll have that one, please. Just one? Yes, please. Anything else? That's it, thank you. Got something to make your way around for me. Thank you. We could go to the one, um, the bar pass. The other one that's near Dad's. Oh, not the bar pass, no way. So we've got drinks, but um, there's basically no vegan food. We don't want this wrap! <laughs> so we've got another chicken and barbecue thing. This you is basically... <laughs> This is basically what we've just had, but in a wrap from Starbucks. Yeah. They haven't got the other two things. We could go to... There is a cheese and marmite one. roll, but apparently it's a bit boring. I mean, um, they don't have it here, but that's what's on the menu. Yeah, it's either the bre there's like a breakfast thing. Hello, welcome to Starbucks. <laughs> you sound like someone then. I'm not being funny. You know, you need to show the top of it. Funny. Look at this <laughs> So... That looks so nice. I'm Isn't mixing. It? Is that the honeycomb one then? This yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. yeah Obviously. Sorry. Why? Because that's honeycomb. Oh. oh. They didn't have the new breakfast sandwich, which has got a Beyond Meat that, patty in. Sorry. Um, or the cheese and marmite chibata, but we managed to get a wrap. But Why it's exactly the get... same as the one that we got at Costa, but from Starbucks. It doesn't smell the same though. Why did we not get a small? Again. Because they always trick me. They always say, do you know what I mean? They're more large. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we've got drinks wise, they've got two new macchiatos. But we've just had hot coffees from Costa. So we're trying the new, what is it? Double chocolatey macchiato and 
honeycomb macchiato over ice with Starbucks's new nut blend milk. Ripples. I'm so excited. I want it like. Oh, I'll just pour it out. Tell it! Oh shit, sorry. Arsehole! She just poured a drink on me! It's on your bag as well. Oh. Sorry. It's like no, it's got no sweet in it at Mine's all. Mine's got enough. Do no we need to stir it? I think we need to stir them. That's meant to be chocolate now. What is that? No, they're meant to be really sweet, aren't they? Honeycomb and chocolate. This is double chocolatey. Maybe they've done it wrong. Oh, that's better. That's a lot better. Oh yeah, mine is as well. Sorry. Starbucks. <laughs> mine. Mine tastes like a cold hot chocolate. It doesn't taste like honeycomb. It tastes like um. Sorry. You'll like that. It tastes like what Tony just had from Costa. What less week. Hey Siri. What is a macchiato? Macchiato. <laughs> Cafe Marchato. Sometimes what? called espresso oh, yeah. marchato. Marchato. Espresso coffee drink with a small amount of milk, usually foamed. Oh, it's more. Do you want me to keep reading? No. Yes, please. <laughs> In Italian, marchato. Siri. Spotted, so <laughs> marchato. I think, you know on like the board where it tells you how much milk to coffee there is, this is the one that's got the most coffee in. Bing! Sounds fly out windscreen. I'm not getting much honeycomb. I'm not getting much of anything to be honest. <laughs> I can't taste coffee, I can't taste... I think if we'd have got it before Costa, it'd have been better, but because we've now tasted Costa coffee. <laughs> uh, it's nice. Mmm. It's not as strong as Costa's flavours. Um, yeah. I don't know. I don't really have an opinion on it. <laughs> I like them both. But the flavours just aren't strong. When we first tried it, there were all the coffee was at the top, wasn't it? Mm. Now it's mixed in. I can't it taste out. any coffee whatsoever. What is it? Well, I don't even know what they are. Honeycomb, whatever you just said. Macchiato. So a coffee with honeycomb. Yeah. A coffee with honeycomb and a double chocolate macchiato. That's like a mocha then. Yeah, essentially. Milk. Doesn't taste nutty. Eh? Doesn't really taste of anything. Uh, no, it really doesn't. <laughs> I think we've failed by having it over ice because the ice is watering it down. If you don't really like coffee, I'd definitely get this. Yeah, this just tastes like a little bit sweet. Grated like this. Who? Oh, crackle. Mm. Starbucks do made them because we fill it with ice. I need like three ice cubes, not 72. Oh, yeah. That doesn't taste of anything. That one, I think it's, At that all. one doesn't. <laughs> I can't taste that whatsoever. Maybe we've got COVID. <laughs> it tastes sweet. It tastes sweeter than that. This one tastes sweeter than that one. Do you think? Yeah, and that's meant to be chocolate. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look, the cinnamon buns. Cinnamon! <laughs> right. hungry. I know I'm really not hungry at all. We thought we were going to do a whole video of both different places. What is this? Barbecue chicken. Basically, what we just got from Costa. In a wrap. Yeah, don't worry. It's beans. Bit. That's not chicken. Not as nice as the other one. Costa one was 10 times better. So, Costa's one. Basically, Costa's won this one. That's got beans stuck? in it. I don't want beans. Mm. Like yeah. Kidney beans. Yeah, it's got a lot of beans in it. Not enough chicken. Mm. It's got some kind of herb. Coriander. Coriander's the devil. Why do people put coriander in I stuff? I don't like that. I don't like coriander. You didn't get a chickeny bit. Take that piece of chicken out. Or eat by that bit. Thing, but I wouldn't pick it over the Costa one. I don't like it. Okay. Like a solid zero out of ten. Really? Yeah. I hate whatever herbs in that. That 
is what all Starbucks vegetarian or vegan wraps taste like. That is exactly That's the what same. they all used to taste like before vegan stuff like actually got better. Starbucks, like you had one job. They just put beans in everything. To beat Costa and you failed. I don't like it's that twang of coriander. Yeah. No. I wouldn't recommend it to someone, but I could eat it if I was hungry. That's, I'd rather starve. Would you? Yeah. <laughs> It's not that bad. <laughs> it is. Costa have pulled it out of the bag and that just... Oh. Oh, well, well, I'm cold now and I'm disappointed in Starbucks. I am. I'd re like, that wrap is actually a zero out of ten. Sorry if that sounds dramatic, but it's disgusting. And I like everything. Don't I? Yeah. I like it. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> From here. Wow, are we are. See? Whose horse is that? Whose horse is that? What? Who's on everything? God, who's inside here? Boing. You tell me. Go, go. I would say 100% star, but uh, Costa won that. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Panini was 10 out of, after that, Panini was 10 out of 10. Yeah. After the Starbucks thing. And the drinks were nice. And the drinks were a lot nicer. They didn't taste like coffee, honeycomb, chocolate or anything. They were just tasteless. They tasted like a B-Tech version of coffee. Yeah. And that, that wrap was <laughs> inedible. But not to me. Starbucks always wins for me, but Costa definitely won oh, this mate. challenge. <laughs> we'll really get shot like a dog on our lap. <laughs> anyway, that is the end of our Costa versus Starbucks vegan 2021 items. I don't know how to describe it. But Costa v Starbucks vegan. Vegan January, yeah. Vegan if you enjoyed the video please subscribe and like this video we've got some more coming we're gonna do a what we're we gonna do like a restaurant style one we're yeah. gonna order it in and um, so nando's frankie menus all that kind of stuff and then we're gonna do a more fast food one as well so we're gonna try out the new subway and yeah all those kind of things so yeah subscribe if you want to see more and i will see you in the next one bye, bye. Oopsie daisy, we have caused oh, a lot. Oh, is it all over? Yeah, have you not seen it? Oh shit. <laughs>